Hi, I'm Marie and welcome to Learn Key's IC3 GS6 Level 3 course on Digital Literacy. Software versioning is used to identify and categorize the unique state of computer software. Unique version names or version numbers are assigned to each software version. The version numbers are generally assigned in increasing order within a version number category. For example, the initial version may be named V1.0. When a newer version is released, it may be named V2.0. Let's take a look at my Microsoft Word version number. I have Word opened on my desktop. I'll select File, and then Account. Under About Word, we can see the version. Finding the version online is a little different. I'll open a Word document online. From here, I will select File, About, and under Diagnostics, we can view the version next to Build. It's important for us to be familiar with the version we are using, so we are aware of version upgrades that may be available. This is especially crucial for technical support. If you are troubleshooting an issue on your computer, upgrading versions may resolve that issue. Correcting issues within versions are not the only reason new versions are created. If we use Word 2016 and Word 2019 as an example, both versions are very similar. The newer version, Word 2019, has some additional features like text-to-speak add-ons and translator available to improve the user's experience. Another way versions improve the user's experience is by creating accessibility. We have local and online versions. Local versions are desktop applications that are installed on the computer like I have opened here. They do not require the internet to use them. Online versions are not installed on our computer. They are accessed through the internet on any device.